Hello friends, if you find no hardware in the Cortex programmer or you don't find the we can say drivers for the USB blaster in the uh, device manager then you can just re see this video to get the whole solution for your FPGA. So the step one is just to press and hold the shift key on your keyboard and then go to the uh, restart to restart your system. Select troubleshoot and then go to the advanced options. In advanced options, just select the startup settings. You can see the disable driver enforcement signature option. So just restart. Just press 7 to disable the driver enforcement signature. Now you can go to the device manager and just update the driver. And when you are clicking on the update driver, you will have the uh, window for the giving the path for the, we can say, drivers of the USB blaster. So just select the path that is, that is shown to you and just install the drivers uh, that are, we can say, available for the Quartus uh, Prime Light. Uh, so just wait for the process to complete. Just select install this driver software anyways. Upon successful installation of the drivers, uh, you can go back to the Quartus and the programmer and you can see your USB blaster. If you don't find the USB blaster there, you just have to go to the hardware setup and you can see the uh, currently selected hardware and if there is no hardware uh, and the USB blaster option, you just have to select the USB blaster option. And when you have selected the USB blaster option, then just close and we will have the uh, your board uh, ready for the, we can say, starting of the program.